Hello, my name is Jonathan Anderson, and this is Axiom Verge. We just got the high jump boots, and we don't know where we're going. Oh, oh, maybe we're going up there. No, that's too high. But, we're going to go exploring. Oh, oh my, this is not what I wanted to do. I think I want to go that way, over there. Yeah, there's a door there that we have not been through. We're going to go that way. Does this bubble hurt me? No, but I can shoot it. That's interesting. Okay. Correct or not, this is new territory. We'll do the new territory. Those poor guys. They do not know why I'm shooting at them, and neither do I. They probably know more about why I'm shooting at them than I do. Oh my word. You would think I had never played a platformer before. There we go. Ah, that's pretty cool. Did I kill it? I think I killed it. Oh, I was hoping that maybe I could jump through that. Looks like I'm not going this way. That's okay. We'll go down here. got all of those mind machines. And we've arrived over here. Oh, I just fell back the way I was. We'll try that again. Hmm. The map tells me there's a way to go this way. But I sure don't see it. Hmm. It's quite possible there's more to this game than I realize. But we'll see. We'll keep exploring. This whole way is new. That's okay. Oh, wait, there's nowhere else to go. Hmm. Okay, there, well, there's more new ways this way, anyway. All right. We've discovered nothing new except for a new dead end. And more undiscovered surface of the map. Hmm. This little corner makes me want something to be in it. Hmm, it's making the noise. Oh, he came right through there. I like those guys, those are pretty cool looking. Oh, I'm almost dead again, I am dead. I wonder what would happen if I pretended that I was actually good at this game and stopped just trying to throw myself at things. Let's see how that feels. Oh my. Oh, I panicked there a little bit. Let's try again. What, the, what does this do? It wasn't the worst. That was alright. See, we're better already. Oh my.
Ah, oh, they're coming from everywhere. Okay. We're going to try that again. One more time before I... I take a break in pure frustration. I'm pretty sure I put this on easy too, which is not helping my satisfaction. I don't know that that's possible for me to see from here though, I'll bet I can see it on the save screen. I sure did take more damage this time than last time. There we go. Oh, look. That's nice. I was just hoping that that would happen. I thought that... Oh, here he is. I wonder if this would work better. That is a weird looking creature. I guess it's supposed to just look like a a spider or a, or a scorpion or something. But my immediate reaction was to see it as like a, a human creature doing a crab walk, which, you know, it's kind of weird. So maybe I couldn't have jumped, I probably could not have jumped up here before because I can only barely jump up here now. So this is probably new. In fact, it is on my map. You know, I haven't said it here, but uh, maybe you enjoy a little bit of this. Maybe you think that uh, I should put more videos up. And if that's the case, and you have opinions on what games I should play, or if you have opinions on whether I should be playing it and recording it alone or with someone else, let me know. You can contact us at gameolder at civilfritz.net. Fact is, we haven't received any mail at that address yet, but you know what, that's fine. We're mostly doing this just because it's fun. I know a few people have watched, and, and that's fun too. And if there's something specific that we could record that you think would be fun also, let me know. Just last night we played some What Remains of Edith Finch. I've wanted to play that for a little while. In fact, I, you, you will know that if you listened to our most recent episode of the Game Older podcast. Which I really also enjoy making. Oh my, there's a thing down there. I think that that increases health. Hmm. How do I get there? Anyway, I've wanted to play that game for a while, but I had in my mind, for some reason, very specifically, that my mother-in-law would like it. My, excuse me, my mother-in-law does not play video games. But she also has it in her mind that video games are one of those things that her children did. And it's not for adults, which of course flies in the face of everything about Game Older. So, it seemed like a great game to play with her, and I hadn't played it before, but something about what I had read about it, what I'd seen of it, made me think that that was probably true. Where am I? How did I not see this door before? 
This is just where I was before, right? I think so. And this is just going to go... I mean, I'll walk through it just to make sure, but this is down here. Yeah. Okay. Huh. I'm going to have to review the videotape to see what was going on there. Did I really just totally space out on that door and not see it? Anyway. If I can take her reaction at face value, she seemed to really enjoy it. It, it was clearly not something that she had experienced before. She kept expecting it to become uh, something like explicit horror, which that game is not for sure. It's more experiential. But there's a creepy factor to being alone in a house, and, you know, that's not something she had seen in a game before, so... It was fun. She and Andy and I all sat and played that together, and of course, because it's a video game and we play games on PC, it had to crash at least once and make us repeat like a 10 minute sequence. So she got a good introduction. So now I have to decide though if we're going to play more of that without her, or if we'll wait for her to come and play more of it with us, which I don't think is likely to happen, so we'll probably just need to decide to play it. Where do I want to go? I can't go this way, so we'll go this way. Oh my. Hey, guess what guys? There's steam in here, and the game is not crashing. Go this way. Oh, this is interesting. I'll bet that means there's a save point over the other way. We'll check that out first. It's not like I'm that far away from the save point, but we'll, we'll, yeah, ooh, look at me. Okay. Let's go check out this boss. Of course, there's a way to go this way, too, so let's not forget about that. Ooh. Ominous sound effect. Oh, yep, there he is. Oh, much bigger. I am the demon. I don't... Do I know Athetos? I think I've heard that before. Okay. Oh my, I'm tiny. That's actually really cool. Did it break any of those blocks? I don't think so. I like this a lot. This is... Very cool. I think I can mostly just hide here. Yes. That's working. You know, I... I talked about my experience playing this a little bit on the Idle Thumbs Slack. I like to hang out there. And when I said that I'd recorded it, Someone there, I don't remember who it was, commented that they tried to play this game and died and decided that the game wasn't worth getting better at or putting in the practice necessary to get better at it. And I'm not going to pretend like I, I I've clearly have not been amazing at this game, but stuff like this, that's like, this guy is intimidating, it looks good. I guess I am playing it on easy, at least I think I am. I should try and confirm that at some point. And I don't mind that I'm playing it on easy. The hard part here is being okay with recording my voice and putting it on the internet. Maybe when we get better at that, uh, I'll go back to betting games on normal while I'm recording it. But for now, I mostly just don't want to put you through even more frustrating death and repetition. So we'll play on easy. I gotta tell ya, like this guy looks cool and I am glad to be fighting him, but I'll bet he is not interesting to watch me fight. 
wonder where I'm supposed to shoot now. I'll bet it's those things down there. Yeah. Maybe he's going to do something the minute I get rid of this last little bit here. I'll bet he starts moving around. Oh, oh I took a hit though. Okay, I'll bet I shoot that now. Oh, there goes the garage door. That's not working. What do I shoot now? Try a different gun. It's an interesting vocal sound effect sample thing now. Oh, oh, I'll bet that hurt me. What am I supposed to be hitting? Ah, that worked. Can I can I just shoot that with my normal gun? Did I not try and shoot that for some reason? Okay, there we go. I was making it too complicated. Ah, I can only hurt him when his mouth is open. I see. Something about this is reminding me of a boss fight from Cave Story. I don't know why. I think it's because I feel bad for the creature there that I've just destroyed in gross pixel detail. Hmm. Oh, nope, that's hurting me. I do not want to do that. Hmm. Can I, I can't jump high enough to get that over there. Huh. That is hurting me, right? Yeah, oh my. Well, we're going to go and take refuge in the save egg. Excellent.